We tried very soon Jim Beam. <laughs> we tried Jim Beam. Colin. Colin. Have we tried Jim Beam? Have we tried Jim Beam? I mean, like one variety. Yeah, I don't think, yeah, I don't think, I don't think I've ever had any more than that. Yeah, yeah so, so uh, good question, Colin. There are different varieties of Jim Beam? Of course there is. We're in a video. I just didn't even think about it. Uh, no, I've only ever had one. If Dermot was here, he'd be having a really good time right now, but Shannon doesn't like whiskey. Mm. Dirty water. Jim Beam original, the OG. Oh look, they're mini shots, they're mini shots. It's a shot of whiskey. Wow. So you're not letting the two the two guys pour their own drinks anymore. Is that how this works? And, and, and on top oh, wow. of that, you're giving us a little shot of whiskey. You expect us to shoot this? You don't shoot this shit, you savor it. What the hell is this bullshit? It's bad enough we can't kiss. I it's love so whiskey. Good. I love it without ice. This is this is how I would drink it. You anyway. like whiskey straight without ice? Yeah. I don't believe you. I find the ice actually ruins it. Jim Beam, him and his gang of boys were like, lads, let's get people fucked up into the future. Can't see it with the sunglasses. Oh <laughs> we have a uh, we have a Kentucky straight bourbon. Oh, just a straight bourbon. That's all. No, no bells or whistles here. No bells, whistles, or decent-sized glasses. <laughs> Clearly. Guys, I'm going to the gym after this, so we're going to try it. But please don't kill me in the comment section. I know you're going to kill me in the comment section. Oh, it smells nice. Oh man, it's, it's yeah. It's still going to be good. It's listen, this thing. It's going to be good. Oh, it's lovely. It's nice. Oh, it's lovely. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh God, oh, Jesus, Jim! I still feel ridiculous. I, I, I feel, I feel like a giant, a <laughs> giant idiot. I had an initial reaction, but I can't help that. But other than that, it went down smooth. That flavor of whiskey tastes like burn. Why? Cut to the other two fucking pairs shooting this <laughs> and being done, being done with it. Whereas we're savoring it. We're, we're savoring taking it. our time. Yeah. In stupid fucking glasses, but still, it would ruin it if I drank all of it. That's the one thing that I find about whiskey. It gets you really warm. Like, if I was trapped in the snow, I would want a bottle of whiskey because I wouldn't be freezing anytime yeah. soon with that. I'm really intrigued to see different types of this. It's a ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. This one is called Red Stag. Yeehaw! Is it still 40% like the last one? Red Stag by Red Jim Stag. Beam, yeah. Sounds like a like a bluegrass album. Yeah, an album I wouldn't buy. Yeah. So it's a liqueur with some whiskey in there. Oh, black cherry. <laughs> black cherry, does it smell like cherry? Well, I had whiskey that tasted like plum before. So no. if this tastes like cherry, we'll be okay. They thought to themselves, let's get Merton and uh, Durbin in for this shoot. They'll be good with a whiskey shoot. We have given them Zero. <laughs> Zero so far. You've given them that much. I've given them that much. Well, they've given us this much as well, like in fairness, exactly. so come on. Mm. Oh, I don't like that at all. Oh, it's that's a mouthwash. Idea. Really wish I hadn't waited to see you go first. Uh. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. If I was a dog, my tail would be like a Oh, wagon. wagon. It's so polarizing, the smell and the taste are like so worlds apart. Oh, that is sweet at the end. It is sweet. It tastes like caramel. It does yeah. taste like caramel. They didn't lie to us, Red Stag. This is the thing. Uh, if you'd given us a, like a proper actual fucking glass of it, um, that I'd be done for the night if, with one of them. Yeah. You know what I mean? Whereas with the other one, you keep refilling that bad boy and I'll, uh, yeah. I'll sit by the fire all bloody night, baby. You know what I mean? Oh, I'll sing you a song. Oh. <laughs> Way oh, way better than the last one. That that has upped the whiskey game. I can understand why people want to drink whiskey if it tastes like that. Yeah. That tastes like pure cough syrup. Cough like, syrup, yes. you've put the, hit the nail on the head with the cough syrup. That is just like venolin. Tastes like fishy venolin. If I had to give this a rating out of 10, mm. I think I'd give it a 10. 10, probably a 10. Jim Beam Devil's Cut. Another word for a vasectomy. Oh, this is a big fancy looking for, oh, oh. No, what? It's going 5% faster down the motorway. Why? Because it's 45%. So while bourbon ages and the angel's share evaporates, some also remains trapped inside the barrel. We extract this dark and intense liquid from our charred barrel walls 
and blend it with extra aged bourbon. Oh wow. Jim Beam Devil's Cut is a distinctly bold bourbon full of rich, intense flavors. That was my uh, English accent. Let's see how much 5% can make the difference. You ready? Oh, I'm no. not ready. <laughs> I can't stop myself doing that, but that is the best one we've had. <laughs> I mean, come I on. I mean, like it's this. just like, what, what more do you want from us? That's just. No. No. It's actually the same as Jemison Black Barrel, that one. Same concept. No, no. no, why? It's like an Aula drink. And now lads just want to suffer. Just sit in my armchair, you know? Uh, you'd christen a baby's head with that. Hey, uh, hey, Martin. Yeah? Why don't you rate it with 10? Um, how, how, about, how about on the count of three, we, we both give our rating. Okay. And and and, and uh, whatever the difference is, we'll, we'll split the difference and that's what the actual rating would be. Okay? So, so one, two, three, and then we say it. Okay? One, two, three, 10. Ah, how about that? Fancy that. They're like different drinks. You can't believe this, they both make the same. You can't compare yeah. this to the one before. I think the Red Stag one is for like children. <laughs> so they, it must be to get, to get them into whiskey. It's like put a bit of Mickey Finn's in it and they'll like, it'll get the sugar will get them in, but they'll stay for the good stuff. Has anyone ever told you those sunglasses are like uh, uh, Tony Stark's uh, glasses in Avengers? Well. The ones he gives to, to Peter Parker. Tap the side of them and say, hello, Edith. Hello, Edith. Anything? Oh, I've got a woman. Oh. Um, name's um, Agnes. Agnes! And she's um, not happy. No? <laughs> not happy that I've woken her up from her um, her daily nap, her oh. afternoon nap. Sorry about that. No, it's Spider-Man thing. I don't know either. Yeah, yeah. She says she doesn't watch those kinds of films because she's too busy banging. Good for Agnes! Fair play, Agnes. Good for Agnes. So this is... <laughs> what do we got? A double oak. Oh. Twice barreled. Oh. Expertly aged, very confident, but I'm, I'm willing to go with it. Yeah, they've, listen. They've been stellar. Double oak, twice barrels, whatever that means. So they put it in the barrel, they threw it away, and they put it back in the barrel again. Yeah. So it's in a white oak barrel, and then what's it in the second uh, time? A charred barrel. A charred barrel. Jesus. They're getting real creative with it now. They're like, what happens if we put it in that one? Yeah. And then we put it in that one for another <laughs> five years. Barrel of laughs, I'm sure. Is there enough? The cherry. Bring back the cherry. There's a lot of tastes going on there. It's hard to even describe. Oh, that is wonderful. Wow. Oh, that wow. is wonderful. It's all good. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh. Can you taste twice the barrel? That's what I'm thinking. I feel like it's coming at me from two barrels, you know? It tastes two times as worse because it went through two barrels. Yeah! That's absolutely delightful. Delightful. Holy hell. It's the wood best. flavored alcohol. Look, this has been a pleasure. Hey, hey, remember the advent calendar video? No. Neither do I. <laughs> Whiskey just makes you that kind of drunk, you know? Like real, like warm drunk. Fair play to the family getting together, you know? Creating a business. Yeah, that's ingenuity. My cigar. My uh, Jim Beam, the uh, what was this one? The the, the double oak, double oak. Yeah. I could I could I could happily sit there for I don't know maybe 48, 72 hours singing songs, singing the old folk songs, the old folk songs, and you know how they go. Do I? Oh, don't you? Oh, when we go down. down. And like, I'm surprised because I don't even like whiskey. So they converted me and then they unconverted me yeah. again. And it's all balanced out by how much we hated the Red Stag one. I hate it, the Red Stag one, both yeah. Both the look of it and the taste of it. 
pull it clean off the market. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for watching and subscribing. No, and wait, thank you for watching and subscribing. Yeah. Yeah, because they did watch they it. They just did, did that after you said it. I'm not even drunk. What does this mean? Like, subscribe and click the bell. I'm telling you now, baby, you know, you're getting it on these.